So behind the scenes here at EKS RX, where the boss, Matthias Ekstrom, is talking to Chris Meek. First of all, hello, Chris Meek. Sorry to interrupt. How are you? I am very well, yeah. Nice to see you. Uh, uh, just a quick word with you, Matthias. Um, not the easiest of Q2s. Uh, Q1 went very well, but Q2 just got very wet very quickly. Tell us about it. It was so funny because uh, we were standing here having our pre-meeting for the session, and uh, we said, oh, it's... Uh, unfair for the guys to go first because the track will improve and I said guys don't forget it can rain even worse so I was right unfortunately so just uh, when the last two heats were about to race the rain came and then the last one even more so we were sliding around it was quite entertaining but unfortunately pretty slow so I won the heat and was okay with this but the total time was nothing really impressive. <laughs> And were you aware of the, the contact with um, Bakurud? Because you and Petter got through and Bakurud got spun out. Yeah, I saw it. So I, I had an okay takeoff at the start and I spun the tires a little, shifted up to the gears and Andreas was in front. So into turn one, I backed off. We had some little rubbing, but then I think Petter and him had contact and he lost the car and I saw him in, flying into the wall. So a shame for him because I think that was a pretty hard hit. And... Uh, Unfortunately, this happens even if you don't want, but in these conditions, uh, when you get oversteer, it very often gets a big one, and uh, the runoff area, when you come from lane five, you cut across, and someone gets you on the, on the corner, the car rotates fast, and I'm hoping he's not hurt himself, because I know the concrete walls are pretty hard there. And uh, for you, it must feel good that you're still in the top 12, despite such a slow, because of the rain, Q2. Yeah, I mean... Rallycross, uh, you should get used to this. Uh, we, all the teams voted to have um, use our free practice results as qualifying, so you would have a 100% sportsmanship event. But now with the lottery, uh, it mixes up everything, so you can't really foresee everything. If you go first or last, the weather is changing. So I believe over a year it evens out, but for sure on the one weekend you feel pretty disappointed when you get caught up by the weather. But in my case, in Q2, we were in the right position. But then, God heaven, it's an outdoor sport. It decided to make a difference. So generally, still, I'm quite happy. My car is in one piece. We're making good progress. Makes it a bit faster, heat by heat. So pretty happy with this. But also Topi, I mean, he's leading overnight. So EKS can be very proud of this. And um, I think that's quite uh, good. So can't complain much. Thank you very much. Good luck. Cheers.